WVTV on your side. WVTV News starts right now. The former mayor of Charlotte could face more prison time for voting. Good evening. I'm Maureen O'Boyle. I'm Paul Campbell. We're glad you're with us. A grand jury indicted Patrick Cannon. We'll stay on top of the story as it moves through the court system. Stay with WBTV and WBTV.com. A new indictment is giving hope to the family of a murdered 16-year-old girl today. The ball President Obama's budget plan includes $75 million to expand the streetcar here in Charlotte. Sun is setting, and you can see, well, clear skies from our HD tower cam. Yeah, and you even notice the moon right there over my shoulder. There Temperatures are certainly going to be falling as the sun goes down. Let's check in with Chief Meteorologist Eric Thomas. At least we don't have quite the wind to deal with tonight. Uh, no, we don't, Maureen. Uh, still well below the average, though. Our high today, only 46 degrees. The average is well into the low 50s at this point in time. But as Maureen mentioned, at least we're not dealing with the wind chill. Have a look outside. We'll show I'll tell you what's up. More NFL investigations seems like they've had about a hundred of them going on all at once, and none of them seem to be uh, getting resolved while we keep waiting on the Patriots. To Don't hold a groundhog to your <laughs> ear. Yeah. I know, right? Like, what's wrong That's with the mayor? This thing. is a cute trick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. Nobody's going to give me a present. Is it that. really tomorrow? Uh, National Weatherman. You think it is, as if I you think. don't have that. Well, thanks for joining.